I'm at Southwest Auto Salvage Yard checking out an old Pacer. And uh, as you can see, I'm not gonna, I don't know how close I can get to this thing, but it's way stacked up. I don't think anyone has anything like this anymore. Kind of cool. Got a little S10 under it, and who knows what the hell is in that pile. I figure they'll probably scrap it out once the prices uh, go. Yeah, a lot of cool parts. You do something with that thing. It's a shame. Like or subscribe if you get the chance. Uh, like or subscribe. I would appreciate it. Um, that's really all I got to say. If you come out, here's that Lincoln. Check that out too for point of reference to find this old jalopy. But if you can, uh, come out and check the place out. They got a lot of cool cars out here, a lot of old stuff, and somewhat new as well. I know they got a white one of these, and I just, growing up in the 80s and 90s, we'd find cars like this and it's like, dude, get a fender, you know, hop one of these things on there, throw a 350 in it, piece it together, and rat rod it. I don't know why people don't do that anymore, but whatever. No Trans Am uh, people out there anymore. There's another one speaking of. Check that thing out. Kind of cool. I think I got that in my last video. My mom had one of them uh, celebrities years back garbage all right people monte carlo i can't get enough of this place in a chevy chevette oh, way up there how about that oh my goodness sorry for the seizure there yeah well have a good one dealing with the rain